your favorite season in New York City? Fall. What's your favorite activity in New York City? Walking. Would you ever leave New York City? Not voluntarily. What are three words to describe living in New York City? Symphonic, tiny, real. Sarah Jessica Parker is an American actress, producer, and designer. She is well known for her role as Carrie Bradshaw on the HBO television series Sex and the City, for which she won two Emmy Awards, four Golden Globe Awards for Best Actress in a Comedy Series, and three Screen Actors Guild Awards. The character was widely popular during the airing of the series and was later recognized as one of the greatest female characters in American television. She later reprised the roles in the films Sex in the City from 2008 and Sex in the City 2 from 2010. According to IMDb, she has 62 credits to her name as an actress and 10 as a producer. What's a book you plan on reading? Uh, Prayers for the Stolen. A book you read in school that positively shaped you? To Kill a Mockingbird. A book you read in school that you never think of? No idea, I never think of it. On a scale of 1 to 10, how excited are you about life right now? 8. 8. Um, oh. Her full name is Sarah Jessica Parker. As of this production, she is 55 years old and was born on March 25th, 1965, in Nelsonville, Ohio, in the United States. She stands at 1.6 meters tall, or 5 feet 3 inches. Unlike her renowned character in Sex in the City, Carrie Bradshaw, Sarah Jessica said she often thinks twice before making a purchase. She said, I'm not a crazy shopper and haven't been for many years. I think I used to be a little more so. Shopping sometimes can give me anxiety. Like, I feel bad, she admitted. She said she often questions her purchases, asking herself if it's something she really needs or if she'll even like it in five years. And it's not the first time Sarah Jessica has shattered fans' illusions that she's not exactly like her alter ego in Sex in the City. In an October 2016 interview with CBS Sunday Morning, Sarah Jessica branded Carrie immature. She said with Carrie, it had to be love, 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 love all the time, which she considered to be childish in a way. And in an October 2015 interview with E! News, Sarah Jessica said she and Carrie have made vastly different life choices. I think there's not a lot about Carrie that's actually similar to my life. My choices have been so radically different, she confessed. There are certain kinds of pillars that fundamentally are different. I like clothing, but I don't have anywhere near the fevered relationship that she does. Parker was in a relationship with actor Robert Downey Jr. from 1984 until 1991. They met on the set of First Born. Downey had a drug problem, which affected their relationship. Parker has said, I believed I was the person holding him together. She later briefly dated John F. Kennedy Jr. Parker married actor Matthew Broderick on May 19, 1997, in Manhattan's Lower East Side, in a ceremony officiated by Broderick's sister. The couple had been introduced by one of Parker's brothers at the Naked Angels Theatre Company, where Parker and Broderick both performed. Their son, James, was born on October 28, 2002. Parker and Broderick's twin daughters, Marion and Tabitha, were born on June 22, 2009, via surrogacy. Their respective middle names, Elwell and Hodge, are from Parker's mother's family, which Parker discovered while researching her ancestry for the first episode of Who Do You Think You Are, which originally aired on March 2, 2010. Here, you can sit here. Great, thanks. <laughs> iPhone or Android? Blackberry. Twitter or Instagram? Instagram. Vine or Snapchat? Neither. Who should everyone be following right now? Uh, a word of the day. What's the coolest thing in this room? Um, I think my... My gloves are Sarah Jessica Parker was born in Nelsonville, Ohio, the daughter of Barbara Parker, a nursery school operator and teacher, and Stephen Parker, an entrepreneur and journalist. She was one of a total of eight children from her parents' marriage and her mother's second marriage. Her full siblings include actors Timothy Britton Parker and Pippin Parker. Parker's parents divorced when she was three and a half years old, and her mother married Paul Frost, a truck driver and account executive. Parker's father, a native of Brooklyn, is Jewish. Her mother is of German and some English descent. Through her mother, Parker is descendant of Esther Elwell, one of the accused during the Salem witch trials. Parker has identified culturally with her father's faith, Judaism, although she has no religious training. She has said that even while her family lived in Cincinnati, her mother emulated a New York lifestyle. Parker's parents struggled to support their large family, Oftentimes the electricity could be shut off, or the family would have to forego Christmases or birthdays for lack of money. Nonetheless, she has stated, 
I wouldn't change any of it for anything. For the most part, we had everything we needed. Not always, but for the most part. Parker's mother immersed her children in culture and extracurricular activities. She often took them to free public institutions like ballet and the theater in Cincinnati so that they lived full, rich lives. As a young girl, Parker trained in singing and ballet and was soon cast in the Broadway revival of William Archibald's play, The Innocents. Her family moved to Cincinnati, then to Dobbs Ferry, New York, near New York City, so that she could get specialized training. There, her mother and stepfather helped Parker develop her career as a child actress. In 1977, the family moved to the newly opened planned community on Roosevelt Island in the East River between Manhattan and Queens, and later to Manhattan. Parker was bringing home paychecks from a young age. Actually, Parker was only eight years old when she landed her first TV show in 1976. Sarah Jessica Parker's major success was starring in the cultural phenomenon that is, of course, Sex and the City. This cult role, which among other things made her fabulously wealthy, was reprised by who else but Parker herself in the 2008 feature film based on the show, Sex and the City, the movie, and in its sequel, Sex and the City 2, which opened on May 26, 2010. Meanwhile, she launched her own fashion line, Bitten, on June 7, 2007, in partnership with discounting clothing chain Stephen Barry's. The line could be found exclusively at Stephen Barry's, featuring clothing items and accessories under $20. Sarah Jessica Parker has also been designing clothes with Halston, and she has a line of best-selling fragrances, including NYC, which brought in $18 million in 2010. She has also appeared in many other films, including the more recent Celebrity from 2013, All Roads Lead to Rome from 2015, and Here and Now from 2018. Prior to the fourth season of Sex and the City in 2001, Parker received a pay rise that also gave her a producer credit. Between acting and producing fees, her salary per episode for seasons 4, 5 and 6 was $3 million. That means she earned roughly $138 million over those 46 episodes before taxes. She earned $13 million for the first Sex and the City movie and around $15 million for the second film. In total, she earned roughly $200 million from the HBO series. Sarah Jessica Parker's net worth is $150 million. Her husband, Matthew Broderick's net worth is also $150 million. In March 2011, Sarah and Matthew spent $18.995 million on a townhouse in New York City, and they proceeded to spend millions renovating the property. It was listed for sale for $24.99 million in 2012. Unfortunately, it could not find a buyer at that level and ultimately sold for $18.25 million, which represented a multi-million dollar loss after renovation costs. In 2016, Sarah and Matthew spent a whopping $34.5 million on two side-by-side -side New York City townhouses. Their new combined mansion has 14,000 square feet of living space, 2,100 square feet of outdoor space, and 50 feet of street frontage. They also own a West Village townhouse, which was purchased in 2000 for $3 million, and two modest homes in the Hamptons, which were bought in 2006 for a total of $6.6 .6 million. Sarah Jessica Parker owns a Mini Cooper. A Mercedes E Cabrio. a Mercedes Maybach, and a Lexus RX 400H.